Hi Athenians, in this video we're looking at differential equations and uh, first of all verifying solutions. Now I've actually already done, done this in um, differentiation um, but it's good to go over it again. So verifying a differential equation is simply differentiating your y value and substituting it into your differ differential equation to see if it holds consistent. So if y equals a half x squared then dy by dx equals x and then our differential equation is dy by dx minus x equals 0. And so substituting our value for dy by dx into here, we've got x minus x, which is 0. Um, and so therefore, we, because this is true, we can verify that um, this is a solution. So we say, therefore, um, y equals a half x squared is a solution of um, dy by dx minus x equals 0. Okay, for our next example, um, we're going to have to double differentiate because this is a second order differential equation. And so this is our function. So I'm going to write it as y equals uv, where u equals e to the x, and v equals cos x. And I might just have to bring up my formula sheet uh, for this one because I always forget whether or not cos differentiates to negative sign or not, and it does. Okay, so du by dx is e to the x, and dv by dx is negative sign x, and so dy by dx is going to be um, e to the x cos x minus e to the x sine x. And so our second derivative d squared y by dx squared. Well, we already know what that differentiates to. It differentiates to that whole function, sine x. And um, this part here is going to be very similar um, to this one, except our v will be sine x, and our dv by dx will be cos x. And so um, this part will... Um, differentiate to um, negative e x sine x um, and then positive um, actually it'll be negative as well uh, e to the x cos x okay so um, that and that will cancel out and we'll just be left with negative 2 e x sine x and that's our value for dy squared by dx squared. Okay, so now we want to substitute all these things uh, back into here. So I'll just write uh, it underneath here and we'll uh, substitute it in uh, underneath. And so um, that bit is going to go in there. Maybe we'll use a little bit of colour coding here. So that's going to go into there. Um, and this bit here is going to go into here. And this bit here is going to go into here. So let's write that all out. So we'll have negative 2 e to the x sine x minus 2 bracket e to the x cos x minus e to the x sine x plus 2 e to the x cos x. And because our differential equation equals 0, we just need to show that um, this will simplify down to 0. And so we'll start by expanding out our brackets. Okay, and so we can um, see here that I've just made a little mistake, that should be plus there. Okay, so this first term here will cancel out with this term here to make 0. And this uh, term here will cancel out with this term here to make 0. And so all of that equals 0, uh, which shows that um, that is a solution. So we can say, therefore, y equals e x cos x is a solution. Okay, so that's how we go about verifying differential equations. 
um, and you've got some practice there, exercise 23.02 and exercise 23.03.